Welcome back to this tutorial series all about using Flipgrid to teach. In today's video, I'm going to show you how students can share their responses to a topic that you post. So far, you have learned how to create a grid, how to share that grid with your students, and how to post your first topic. Now it's time for your students to actually respond to that topic. So I'm going to show you how it's done right now. Let's jump on my computer and we'll take a closer look. So in my last video, I showed you how I created this topic in my grid. Now I wanna show you what this looks like from the student's view. So when students log in, this is what they'll see. And if they scroll down, they will see this assignment that I just created. So they can click the play button Hey students, and, and the video I recorded will appear, and then after they've watched the video, read the information, if I had any attachments here, they would go through those, and then when they are ready, they're gonna click the green plus sign. They do need to be logged into a Google or Microsoft account, but basically, they are going to be able to record a response to the assignment in the exact same way that I created this video right here. So they'll have the options to make it fun with the stickers and the drawings and different things, but it will be cut off at two minutes and 30 seconds because that's what I've set the video for. So after they submit their response, it will go to you first or to me. And because I've set it to a moderated setting, I'm gonna approve it, and then basically all their responses are going to appear down here, just like a grid, and that's where we get the name Flipgrid. There are literally so many fun ways that you can be using Flipgrid to teach, whether you're teaching in a classroom or in an online setting. And I would love to hear from you. What are you using Flipgrid for? Leave a comment below and let me know, and then make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel so that way you don't miss out on any of my latest videos. Until next time, happy teaching.